Hello and welcome back to Roborimo tutorial. In this video I will explain how to use the level indicator. So I measure the battery level with the Arduino and display it in Roborimo. I use the internal voltage reference which for Arduino Nano is 1.1 volts. So when I read the analog pin the voltage on this pin must be between 0 and 1.1 volts. To achieve that I am dividing the battery voltage using two resistors. So for the 3 AA batteries, which is 4.5 volts, I get 0.93 volts on the pin A0. To reduce the noise, I am acquiring 20 samples here and then make the average value. After this line, I get a numerical value, which for the 10-bit ADC is between 0 and 1023. After this line, the value of V will be the number of millivolts on the pin A0. And here I am applying the reverse formula of the voltage divisor and I get the battery voltage in millivolts. I measured the resistors and used their actual values here for a more accurate voltage reading. And here I am composing the string that I sent to Roboimo. This is how the output looks like in the serial monitor. By the way, this is the voltage of my computer's USB port. Now I'm disconnecting the USB and attaching back the Bluetooth module. I power it on and connect with Roborimo. Now I edit the user interface and add a level indicator. The string sent from the Arduino starts with BATT space, so the text before this space is the ID for the level indicator. So I set its ID and I see the level change which means it's receiving the value from the Arduino. And the value is so small because I'm sending about 4.5 and the default maximum for the level indicator is 255. So I'm changing the maximum to 5. I can also add a label to the level indicator, so I will type here battery. And I see it appears there. I can make the label text bigger, so the text size I set to 40 for example. And I can also include the level value inside the label. So I edit the label value again. And the special string for the level value is ds star 1. And I also want the unit which is volts. And I see the integer value here but I also want 3 decimals. So I go to the level indicator settings and set the decimal count to 3. I can make the indicator vertical if I want. And I can also change its color. 